Hi, I'm Katherine Hatherly, a lab technician here at Dell Tech. Today we are going to talk about flashpoint testing, which is part of Dell Tech's product safety laboratory services. Flashpoint testing is required for consumer chemicals such as glass cleaners, hand sanitizers, or surface cleaners containing alcohol like ethanol or IPA, as well as workplace chemicals such as lubricants or solvents. These products often contain one or more flammable chemicals. Flashpoint testing determines if the overall mixture is flammable. A flashpoint is the lowest temperature, corrected to standard pressure, at which the application of an ignition source causes the vapors of a liquid to ignite. Flashpoint is important because it determines the product's chemical classification for both shipping and labeling. It is required for a flammable liquid classification under the globally harmonized system of classification of labeling of chemicals. This is also known as GHS and the Consumer Chemicals and Containers Regulations, the CCCR. Dell Tech performs two standard test methods for flashpoint testing. The first is ASTM D56, standard test method for flashpoint by TAG closed cup tester. And the second is ASTM D93, standard test method for flashpoint by Penske Martin's closed cup tester. Today we will talk about ASTM D93. ASTM D93 uses a Penske Martin's closed cup tester to determine the flashpoint of liquids with a high viscosity. This is products with a similar consistency to hand creams, gels, and lotions, or liquids with a tendency to form a surface film under the test conditions. The liquid specimen and the cup are pre-cooled if necessary to ensure that when testing begins, the sample temperature is at least 18 degrees Celsius below the expected flash point. Then it is placed in the cup of the tester. The Penske Martin's closed cup tester stirs the sample at a specific rate while also heating the sample at a slow and constant rate. The ignition source is applied at specified temperature intervals. Stirring is stopped only to apply the ignition source. The sample is deemed to have flashed when a large flame appears and instantaneously propagates itself over the entire surface of the test sample. The observed flash point is corrected for barometric pressure. Determining an accurate flash point for a product is important to ensure compliant classification. For example, a mistakenly low flash point can trigger supplementary costs related to shipping, packaging, and storage. On the other hand, a mistakenly high flash point can incorrectly classify a product as less hazardous than it should be, causing incorrect or missing hazard warnings. This can be a risk to those involved in manufacturing, shipping, storing, and using the product. Deltex Laboratory is ISO 17025 certified and has the necessary equipment and trained staff to perform flashpoint testing both ASTM D93, as we discussed today, as well as ASTM D56. Our staff can assist you with testing and classification for GHS, CCCR, and CPSC. If you would like more information about the Transportation of Dangerous Goods, Department of Transportation, or GHS requirements in Canada or the United States, please contact Deltec Laboratories for further details.